I am sorry. This was actually supposed to be last week's video, an unboxing video. That's why there's a bunch of there's a pile of stuff here. You done? Thank you. Anyway, this is. Anyway, before I was rudely interrupted, I was supposed to do an unboxing video last week. Just some stuff happened in the mail, some stuff arrived late, some, one package was supposed to arrive Friday, another package was supposed to arrive Saturday, and then a package got, got lost in the mail and the people said it was going to arrive a little bit later. They said by Sunday if it doesn't come, I waited until today because, you know, Sunday there's no mail. And, uh, yeah. So, um... I lost a package. It's okay. Anyway, so, uh, we're gonna start with the... Okay. We're gonna start with you then. What do you want to say? Okay. So as I was trying to say, before I was rudely interrupted by my own child, is we're gonna start with the books. Now I got a lot of books. You done? <laughs> I love how I just sit and wait for him to finish. <laughs> anyway, so we're gonna go off the books. Now some of these books are uh, this hardcover thingy was coming off. So some of these books are for D&D, because I'm trying to get into D&D, and I kind of am. Like, I'm into D&D, but I've never played a game yet, but I'm working on it. So, first book is a Troll Hunters book. Now, this is a Netflix show that's made for kids, but this is a good story. I haven't started reading this one, but I do like to read when I'm interested in something. God dang it, Bird, get Go in your house and do that! Nobody needs to see you scratching your butt! I forgot it's uh, molting season for birds, so his feathers are falling out like crazy, so new ones can grow in. Oh great, I'm gonna have to clean all that up because you don't know how to clean up after yourself. Scratch under your wings some other place. <sighs> Found the public. No respect! <laughs> so yes, Troll Hunters. Good story, um... The book, I'll say, because I did kind of start reading, like, the first two pages. Not the same as the show. I will say that. It's, like, completely different. They took out one of the good characters, in my opinion. Anyway. And they also added a character I never knew existed. That's one. Why is the book sticky? It must have came sticky. Anyway. Now. Wait. Not these books. Because I have more Troll Hunter books. <laughs> These are the comics of the Troll Hunters. These are pretty good. Uh, this is the one of the other Troll Hunter books that are the uh, a brief. I don't even get to pronounce it. It's just a book about the troll lore of this thing. It's like the modern version of what they used to have, and these are just some of the inserts that fell out <laughs> that are actually posters that I'm going to definitely use in my room. And then there's this book, another Troll Hunter book. This is actually an entire, this is pretty much the entire TV show. <laughs> now it went on for three seasons. And then there's also side stories to this Troll Hunter thing, but this is the main story. For an example, um, shoot, what's a good side story to like a main show that, it's not like a spinoff because it's made by the same people. I don't know. Something like that. <laughs> okay, so then the other two books I got, Ready Player One and Ready Player Two. I watched the movie, and the movie was in one of the packages, but it got lost. That was a good movie. So I wanted to read the books. I got, the bo I got both of them. Because I don't know if the movie is based off the first and second book, or is it just based off one of them? I guess I'll find out. 2044. I wonder if we're still gonna have to wear masks then. <laughs> Just saying. <laughs> okay, on to the D&D &D stuff. So I got the starter kit. 
Um, and in this starter kit, I don't have a table, so I would normally do this actually on a table. Oh, and I got some extra dice. I'll uh, probably cut to a part where I can show you all the dice. But um, I got the starter kit, came with some character sheets and the rule book and all that. And I bought some extra dice because I did not know that the set came with dice. So yeah, I have like six sets of dice now. Eh. The sets of di the five sets of dice I bought were actually pretty cheap. Now, I got another cookbook! If you know me and one of my long-term subscribers or one of my good friends, you know I have a weird obsession with cookbooks. I just like to read cookbooks and you know I love cooking. So I got the D&D cookbook, finally! Next is the Harry Potter cookbook that I actually bought for my mother one year for her birthday and she loved it. Okay. I think it was for her birthday. I think it was or it was our Christmas present. I bought it for my mother. So, another one. On to the next package. Because like I said, I had two different packages. Technically, the Amazon package, which is all the D&D books and all that, was, was up to four boxes, but I lost one of the boxes. And then the other three came, so... This is a completely different package for a completely different site. I thank Father for letting me use his Amazon Prime account because I do not have one and everything was a lot cheaper. <laughs> anyway, so um, there is a person on TikTok by the name of Miss Bench. Miss Dot Bench. Like, Miss Period Bench. And she, yeah, she, uh, has a fidget toy company called Fidget Toys Plus. Now for a while, I've been wanting to buy some, and now I have the money, it sounds like there's green in my hair. <laughs> Probably the weird lighting. Anyway, so, uh, I got some fidget toys from her. I got one of these snakes. I've already played with these before in the past at my school, and we used to do them like this. Or the other way we would do it is we try to invert it where it was instead of blue diamonds, it was white diamonds. I got a wacky track. These things are fun to play with. I might buy another one just so I could uh, mix and match the colors. So much fun to play with this. My favorite actually is this color changing stress ball. It goes from purple to green. It looked like a pimple. <laughs> another one that I really like and is so adorable. Look at this little kitty! He's so cute! Smush! I did that when I first opened it. I just like put it on, put it on my uh, counter, and I just smushed it with my fist. I was bored, okay. And then another one of these, and I'm definitely gonna. Oh, sorry, I was stuck under one of the books. Is a monkey noodle or a stretchy noodle? She called them munch monkey noodles in her videos, but on her website they're called stretchy noodles, which is just a long piece of rubber, and you can whack people with them. <laughs> I was playing with this for a while when I got it. I feel like I ordered more. Like, besides what I have here. Now this one is called a Mesh and Marble. Now, she told me these are, in her videos, she said that these are one of the best fidget toys to do when you need to be, qu when they're quiet. Because they're, uh, the quietest toys. I'm just having a problem where mine got shipped and the, one of the parts named Fully gets sewn. Um, I didn't email them that because I'm not one of those types of people. <laughs> But uh, I am going to sew that back up myself because, fun fact about me, I know how to sew. It was one of the things my family has taught, sorry. It was one of the things my family taught me how to do, like one of the things that, you know, oh, you know, you should learn how, you should know how to cook, bake, and sew, and clean and stuff. Like one of the things they taught me on how to survive, like, or like, things like that. So that was what I was taught, sewing, cooking, baking and cleaning, but also, I was also a self-taught sewer. They taught me some other stuff too. Anyway, now this one is a puzzle ball. You're supposed to get the same color in their holes. The only downside is I don't like it as much as I thought I would. There's a foam, really hard piece of foam in there, right in there, <laughs> and you're supposed to, and you have to press like so hard to move it that it, it actually is upsetting me more than helping me relax. 
I mean, moving it back and forth like this is not bad, but like if I want to solve it, I have to like stare at it and concentrate. I don't like that. But I do like the colors though. They're nice and pretty. Now, does anyone remember fidget cubes? Well, I got a fidget pad. Ha ha. There's all different things. That's loud. That's also loud. These two are soft. There's a, a joystick type thing. One of these that's like a pen in a way. Which I don't get how this could be a pen because normally pens go up and down, up and down. There's a couple of rollers, a switch, which I like just doing this, the sound also. Then there's a, uh, a twirly thing. <laughs> it's hard to use it because there's only one dot to get your finger gripped on and I lose it all the time. But yeah. So that's uh, mainly all the stuff I got. I am getting addicted to these again. <laughs> I have pretty much the first day I got it, I wouldn't stop playing with this color change ball. I was just squeezing it. Now, the reason I have these is, if you don't know, I have ADHD. And one of my things to keep my hands busy, which is called busy hands, there's another term for it. It's more like nobody can pronounce, also known as professional voice and name in psychology. But the easier way to say it and for people to understand it's called busy hands. Now, as you know, sometimes I play with my hair, trying to get rid of that habit. So I'm thinking some of these might prevent me from playing with my hair. And if I remember correctly, I haven't played with my hair all day. I'm playing with these. They also wrap them in cellophane plastic, and that's another thing I like to play with. I don't know why, but cellophane plastic actually is really fun to play with. <laughs> I like the sound of it. I'm gonna stop. Yeah, sorry about the low quality video. Like I said, I'm on my phone. My camera broke. Uh, so, uh, I honestly don't know what else to say. Uh, if you want, I'm going to put all the links to all the stuff I just bought in the description below. Like I said, I am missing two packages, so I'm on a, one of them's a movie and the other one's a video game. And, uh, I lost it. So I couldn't, you know, get it. This is sticky. That's the other thing I don't like about this is these stress balls are sticky and they're getting dusty. Then I'm going to have to clean them again. He cleaned it. Anyway. I like playing with it. But no, play with my mission mobile. So, uh. You'll be getting some videos soon. More videos, hopefully, like, constant. I've been really busy. And the reason I couldn't post, like, I had everything ready. Um, I was told that one of my packages was going to end up on Friday, and I'm like, okay, I'll record it Friday night. Uh, because they weren't going to arrive till 4, and I'm like, okay, I'll just record a quick video of me showing everything. And then I, then I heard the other one, this fidget one, is coming out, um, that was coming Saturday. I'm like, okay, I'll probably make it a two-part video and do the second part for next week's video with a combination of, you know, a different video. Because I knew this was only going to take, like, five minutes. So, uh, yeah. Then I was like, oh, wait, one of my packages is... Delayed. Uh, I'll just wait till that one then. So I didn't have another video. Normally, because of how I am, I would always have a backup video in case I did lose a video. But because I don't have the old computer, most of my backup videos are gone. I do have a couple of videos recorded on my camera. Well, my camera's dead. It's not working. Um, that I could, that, on the SD card that I could possibly just use for now. Because there are some there. I did do a small vlog. Um. But yeah. Oh, oh no, the marble came out. Oh, that, ah. That's because one of the ends is busted, so the marble will fall out. So, gotta be careful. I will sew this back up probably with some stronger thread. Um, probably some embroidery floss too because that's a little bit thicker than just normal thread. And I might also reinforce this side too, the side that's still closed, just to be on the safe side. Because I don't want to be like playing in the doctor's office and lose the marble. 
And I do know there is a way you can take the marble out, which I don't like doing that. I, I wouldn't like that. I am though supporting small businesses as much as I can. Like I said, not, not the uh, most, uh, not the most uh, best person when it comes to money. I got bills. But uh, yeah, I am trying to support uh, small business owners. I actually do have my own small business. And I don't have a product because my products are made to order and I don't need to make one until a couple weeks from now. Because uh, the only person that's ordering them is literally lives down the street from me. And they don't, they pretty much pay me cash. Yeah, I don't have a product at the moment because I, I pretty much did end up selling my last one. So I gotta make more soon, but that's not till like next week, maybe. Probably I'll do go more in detail about my shop, my little Etsy short store in uh probably in the next couple of videos. Just wait for me. <laughs> I gotta get a product out and ready too. I do make them. All, I do make my uh products on TikTok. I do have a TikTok app, by, by the way. If you wanna follow me there, I mainly just post random stuff. I can't make TikTok videos to save my life, I'm telling you. I can't wait till I get the three minute stuff because I'll be better at that than that. And then uh, make it one minute videos. I cannot make one minute videos. I ramble too much. I did go shopping though for food. <laughs> uh, vlogs are supposed to be random as hell. And I think I'm doing so randomly. <laughs> I think it's also because I'm just tired too. I haven't been sleeping too well the past few days. Bird, you look fat. <laughs> I don't know why I just said that. You do look fat though. I mean, you are in blob mode. Blob mode is where he just sits and his whole body just flops. <laughs> He's a little chunky bird. He's so cute. I love him so much. Well, that's gonna be it for this video. Uh, liked it, like it if you liked it. Uh, comment, I don't know, whatever, I just, this is another thing. Before I end the video, I wanted to say this. Can, do you guys ever see my videos? Like, do you guys actually see them? Because I'm getting no comments and nothing, like, no interaction at all, and I'm just, like, thinking that nobody's seeing my videos, and the views I'm getting is me just checking up on my videos every so often. So if you can, just please comment if you are seeing this video because I really want to know if people are actually watching my videos because I do spend a good amount of time making videos. I know my videos aren't the best looking in the world right now. Got the sweat on my nose. Uh, saying They're not the best quality at the moment, but I am working on them. Like I said, my camera just broke, so I'm using my phone as a recording. Worst idea ever. But I have nothing else to record it on. Like I said in my other video, I have a camera, but the issue is, is I can't listen to what the camera records until I put it into my actual computer. So it's just a little bit of a longer process. Now I will probably start trying to do that once I get like what volume I'm supposed to be speaking in. Do I need to hook up a do I need to buy an external mic for it? Stuff like that. Because if I have to buy an external mic, that's gonna be a lot more money. Bird, you got anything you want to say? All right. Um, he just nods his head, like, he literally just, like, nodded his head. It was so funny. <laughs> you are... If you guys actually want to see a video of just the bird, I'm actually working on that video right now. I have an entire hour's worth of footage of just bird. Being bird. Although it's not going to be an entire hour-long video. It's just going to, you know, probably going to end up being 30 minutes or something, but because I, I got to cut a bunch of it out. Bird! Behave yourself. <laughs> All right, bye humans. Uh, like I said, like the video. Please comment if you're actually watching these videos. I really don't know if you guys are watching these or not. Um, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. <laughs>